I want to show you all the things that do not work very well to make a Nerf holster. The one on the screen is a good one that I made, that's in a different video, but this one I want to show you all the stuff that I did wrong. In the oven, 350, 10 minutes, way too much, shouldn't have done that. I'm about to get these out, it stinks a lot. I looked up more information and 200 degrees for a couple minutes is a much better amount of time. What I did melted the snot out of the Nerf blaster. I also sat on it for over 10 minutes trying to let it cool and it still hadn't cooled. I may have just melted the Nerf blaster. So you get to find out with me. Well, it doesn't look like it formed a whole lot. It's still pretty floppy. I'm gonna put it back in. I pulled this low density foam out and left just the high density stuff in, so we'll see if that made a difference in the forming. I used cheap camp mats in my press. High density closed cell foam would definitely work better. Pressure matters a lot, so clamp your boards together instead of sitting on them. Not too bad though, for a first try. <laughs> I'm gonna attempt a taco wrap. Basically, instead of having a piece on both sides, I'm gonna wrap it around the blaster, put it in the foam. I'm not sure how I would have attached a taco holster, but I figured I'd try it. Also, I still had the oven at 350 and it was really hot. <sighs> That's hot. Shaping it with my hands in advance and only using high density foam in the mold definitely gave me a better form this time. And it was still warm enough that I could form it a little bit after I took it out. Probably should have put the back on. can't get it down. It's a pretty decent fit. It kind of sticks to itself. A lot. <laughs> okay. Um. Ah! <laughs> I got it. It's a little more difficult than you think it'd be. If you haven't seen my video on how to make a good holster that works, or how to make my plaster cast that I use so I don't have to melt a hammer shot every time I make one of these. Click on the links on the screen, it'll take you to those videos. And also subscribe to my channel so you can catch more cool stuff in the future. Thanks for watching.